Hello, everybody! Firebro999 here. Welcome back to more Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Today, we're hopping on that Grand Prix 200cc, and we're going to be playing as one of my good, good, quite interesting friends, Ambi. Oh, boy. And she requested specifically that I use the Moo Moo suit. I, I just... I, I don't even know. Anyway... <laughs> We're gonna pick uh, an ATV here because I kind of miss using these and we'll use Azor rollers and parachute I don't know. It's a random uh, setup. So given the fact that she wants me to use the Moo Moo costume I thought why not save her episode for the shell cup because Moo Moo Meadows is here That's the only reason anyway, let's begin. Oh No <sighs> Moo Moo Meadows, okay, if you're wondering why I'm acting like so Oh my god, it's it's because Amber, I love her very much. She's a very dear friend of mine. But <laughs> if you know, you know. This costume has a very interesting animation when you do a trick off of like an anti-gravity section, I think. So you won't be able to see it on this track, but on the next one, I believe it has an anti-gravity segment. The animation of it is twerking. <laughs> and Amby makes a lot of quite interesting jokes. I don't know. I mean, the suit fits her, but... Oh, man. I, I gotta do this on camera, though. This is crazy. But anyway, let me stop talking about that. We'll get to that point when we get to that point. It's been a while since I played some Mario Kart on the channel, so... Well, not really. It's only been, like, a few videos for you guys, but... In terms of me, like, playing it... I pre-record pre a lot of these in advance, so it really has been a while since I played this, and I keep forgetting I'm on 200cc, so these are going by fast. I gotta come up with, like, things to talk about, because these races happen so fast. I'm so rusty, I gotta keep remembering to use my brakes, because that is very important. Whoa! Now let's prepare for that one. Okay, there we go. Not a bad start. Looks like Waluigi's gonna be the main rival here. Let's keep on going. Mario Circuit, you're about to see the funny animation here. Oh my god. Oh, Waluigi, come on now. Whoa! Man. Use your brakes, FB. Oh, you're about to see it. Oh, no! I'm getting yellow marked for this one today, am I? No, not really. Probably not. I mean, it's harmless, but... This paired with Ambi is like complete chaos. I will say. This is like an early retro cup, so the computers aren't going to be that difficult to deal with, though. That's a good thing. Oh, you freaking tried it. Whoa, I drifted the wrong way. I have to step my game up. Woo! Oh, that was so close to. I gotta keep remembering, I don't have to, like, do tricks everywhere. Oh, why would you sneak it up on me? No! Okay, you know what? That works out. I'm fine with that. As long as everybody gets hit by it. Oh, pff. He ran on a banana peel, too, so... Hey, it worked out for me. Alright, let's keep it moving. Cheap, cheap beach! Oh, man. I've already said this in, like, the past two episodes I played this cup, but, like, I love this track so much, dude. The music is relaxing. The atmosphere. Like, God, Mario Kart 8 is such a beautiful game. Oh, 
You know, that's one of the reasons I love um, cartoony style games. No, nothing against like realistic graphics, but it's such an overdone trope nowadays. Like, a lot of publishers are focused on making hyper-realistic graphics. Well, certain companies, not all of them, but, you know, that's why I like these cartoony style games, because when you take these games and these art styles, and you make them look HD, I, I know it sounds like I'm contradicting myself, but I mean, HD cartoony games, like, you get this gorgeous art style that can't be replicated anywhere else, like, look at this, that is so pretty. Now, I'm not saying hyper-realistic games don't look good, but, you know, it's something that these cartoony styles, you know, it's a certain charm to it, you know? Alright, I'm ready. I see Waluigi hating on me, still. That was close. Ah, almost had that. Whoa! Oh, they're hating. You freaking tried it. Oh, I saw a blue shell coming too. Oh, if that thing came like any earlier, it could have been wraps. Toad's Turnpike! Oh, snap, what a good ending. See, even though I was like, uh,. Very nervous this episode. Because when I play as a friend's me, I want to do, like, the best possible. I don't want to disappoint them. Oh, is that a shell after me? That is some next level hating. I really was outrunning that shell for a while. No matter how many red shells you throw at me, I will be ready for it. Oh, I meant to do a trick right there, but, eh. Not like it matters. Oh, snap. Let me drop a bomb right there. I probably should have saved that. Ah, uh, they were hitting me with the blue anyway. I don't even care. Oh, Waluigi is right behind me, and he's invisible. No, sir. I am definitely going to hang on to this. I don't know when I'm gonna have to use it, but... These people are plotting out here. Oh god, I was so focused on looking behind me that I almost crashed. Bro, he is creeping! Okay, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. Ooh, dear. There we go! Woo! We got the perfect 60, let's go! Oh snap everybody, we got the 60! <sighs> you love to see it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. If you enjoyed, make sure you hit the thumbs up button, comment down below your thoughts on the video, subscribe, or become a channel member and get early access to more videos, and yeah! I'll see you guys next time. You all have a good one. Oh yeah, yo! Yeah.